Hello everyone, welcome to uh, Dispatch. This is a game, an indie horror game that's on um, itch.io. I saw it on there and I thought oh, it looks quite good. So we're gonna give it a go. Uh, you know I love my indie horror games. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna give it a go. Uh, give us two seconds. Everything looks good. Excellent, all right. Uh, password, um, I don't know. Um, Any old password then, I guess. This looks quite cool. Alright, cool. So, interact. Hey there, son. I noticed that you haven't been filling out the reports on the calls you've been doing recently. Listen, I know that you must be pretty torn up about what happened, and... Like I said to you before, this isn't on you. No one's blaming you. What happened? He shouldn't have gone in the way he did. He should have waited for the right people to come and... Like I said, no one's blaming you for that. Now, just don't stay in all night again and just fill out the reports on your calls, okay? I hope you feel better soon. I'll keep in touch. Thanks, mate. Uh, okay. So, something happened. Uh, they, you know... Whatever. Uh, okay, Chris Stone. And they must be grieving. So something happened. Happened. We need an ambulance, quick! All right, calm down. Tell me what's happened. He's going to die. Oh God, how could I let this happen? Uh. What do I do? Who's gonna Who's gonna die? Gus is. Gus. What's happened to Gus? He's eaten a whole Snickers bar. Okay. Is he allergic to nuts? Well, no, but dogs aren't supposed to have chocolate, are they? Oh, right. He's a dog, is he? Uh, he'll be fine. Just call a vet. He's a dog, bruh. Minor. Dog ate Snickers. So these are examples. Incident status resolved. Woman was cooking pancakes for her partner and some butter slashed, splashed on too. Great. Hello, emergency. Finally. I was beginning to think I would never get an answer. All right. What's your emergency? That wasn't much of an apology. I don't care. What's the emergency? I am being forced out of this shop unwillingly. It's 3 a.m. You shut an hour ago, man. I am a paying customer, and you cannot force me to leave. What is your name? You don't have the right to know my name. I can't help you. Useless. I will be calling your manager first thing in the morning. Sure. Glad to be of service. Bye bye. Minor. Moaning. Biarch. Submitted. Right. Oh, this is. What's, what's this then? I mean, the stuff there. Is there anyone behind me? Crikey. Hello? Someone is trying to get into my house. Alright, what's your address? It's 54 Raymond Street. Do you know who they are? It's got to be my ex-husband. What's he doing? He's been banging on the windows and calling out for me. He's not allowed to be here. Why is he trying to break in? He wants to see our daughter. He was meant to be here a few days ago. But he didn't show up. Uh, what did he miss? Sophie? She's our daughter. She lives with me. He gets visits. I'll see. I'll get a unit on the way to calm things. <laughs> oh, no! He's broken in. Tell him to hurry. <laughs> Unit's on the way. Stay calm. I got oh, something in my, in, the, in my office. Uh, they're going to be a couple of minutes. I'm going to give the phone to my daughter and try to talk Liar! To her. What's happening? Uh, if he's aggressive, go to he your daughter. Stop until he finds her. Uh, just make sure he doesn't then. Hello? Uh, hey, what's your name? Sophie. Sophie. Who are you? I'm a police officer. My dad is gonna come last week but Mate, I, 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 I'm expecting something to 
Do you know why he didn't? Right, let's fill this out. Major. Husband trying to break in. Was it 52? Yeah, that's great. What's the address? Fifty-two. Something road. Name. Sophie. Unit assigned. They're shouting again. Where are you in the house? I'm, I'm downstairs. Okay. In the living room. Now, oh, what's the unit number? Eight nine oh eight. Uh, be better if you went to your room. Eight nine. Oh, can't they just stop fighting? Uh, they will, but they need you to go upstairs. Okay. I'm going to run past them and go into my room. Okay, Sophie. You do that. <laughs> Sophie! Come here, you. Stop it. Stop it. Let her go. <laughs> <laughs> the voice acting is awful. But it's a good game so far. It's so dark in here. Have you not got a light? What the f I asked for light and I got it. Turn off. Sophie, are you okay? My dad just... My... My mommy... Mom! This has turned to a murder. Come on, police. Hurry up, like. You're being... You're being proper slow. This is creepy as hell. Has your dad hurt your mum? Yes. Uh, where are you now? I'm, I'm upstairs in my room. I can, I can hear him breaking stuff. Just do I have a lock on it? No, but I, I could put a chair in front of it. Mum did it once. Do it quietly and stay what calm. What are you doing? I can smell smoke. Uh, you can smell smoke. Is he set fire to the house? Push chair against the door. Oh, all right, I'll, I'll try. They're there, they're there. I'm putting the phone down. Come on, police, get there, quick. So, are you in there? Why are they taking so long? Come on, like. <laughs> You're going to send fire. Sophie, you're right or what? <laughs> this is proper it's creepy. Gone. No. Really bad. Uh, you need to leave now. <gasps> I, I can't get out of here on my own. Please, please tell them to help. Dispatch, this is unit 8908 approaching the property now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need fire services here ASAP. Okay, cool. I'll get it. I'll get it done. I'll get some way. The child is trapped inside. Damn it. The fire is very intense. The first floor is engulfed. Uh, kids on the second floor. We might be able to get in and out in time if we knew which room she was in. Uh, Sophie, I need to get you to a room and no, window and open it. Too much smoke. Do it. They'll, they'll be able to figure out where you are if you open okay. the window. Okay. I'm going to do it. Do it. Well done. Please be quick. I see her. Stay there, kid. We're coming. <laughs> what the... Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Come here, kid. <clears throat> I got you. What are you? It's all right. <clears throat> We're getting out of here. Oh. Is there any way to avoid that ass kicking? Two hours is pretty good. It's very good, actually. I really did enjoy that. Voice acting was a bit suspect, but hey, this is an indie horror game, so I can overlook that fact. But that was that was phenomenal. Really well done. Uh, it's a really interesting concept, uh, and it did get me at the end there. Yeah, cool. So 
yeah i liked it hope you guys did too if you did remember to leave a like comment down below as well about what you thought about the game and subscribe to the channel to support i'll leave the link to the game down there go and download it if you've got a pc and you want to play this game throw in a bit of money as well to support the developer where you can if you're able uh, but yeah for now guys take care and i'll see you in the next one Thank you.